Hello, dear friends and fellow believers. Welcome back to God First. Today's powerful exploration of Psalm 5, a sacred scripture that serves as a potent prayer to ignite and guide our mornings. In this video, we'll dive deep into the wisdom, guidance, and motivation this psalm offers, empowering us to start our days with intention, faith, and purpose. But before we begin, if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you won't miss any of our upcoming content. Let's get started. Section 1. Invocation of God's Attention Absolutely, I'm glad you found that part helpful. Psalm 5 verses 1-3 is a powerful foundation for morning prayer, emphasizing the significance of seeking God's attention and committing to this practice. Let's delve deeper into these verses. Verse 1. Give ear to my words, O Lord, consider my sighing. Here, the psalmist earnestly calls upon God, asking for divine attention. The term give ear signifies a plea for God to listen attentively, not just to the words spoken but also to the emotions, represented by sighing. This sets the stage for an intimate and heartfelt connection between the psalmist and God. Verse 2. Listen to my cry for help, my King and my God, for to you I pray. The psalmist addresses God as both their King and their God, recognizing God's authority and their personal relationship with Him. The plea for God to listen to their cry for help emphasizes the psalmist's reliance on God's strength and guidance. Verse 3. In the morning, Lord, you hear my voice, in the morning, I lay my requests before you and wait expectantly. This verse highlights the commitment to morning prayer. By starting the day with prayer, the psalmist acknowledges God's responsiveness to their cries. There's a deliberate act of laying down requests before God, coupled with an attitude of expectancy and trust in God's faithfulness to respond. This section beautifully sets the stage for understanding the intimacy of communication with God, the urgency in seeking divine attention, and the faith-filled expectation that characterizes morning prayer. Section 2. Seeking Guidance and Protection. Absolutely, verses 4 to 6 in Psalm 5 articulate a profound plea for guidance and protection against adversaries, echoing sentiments relevant to our contemporary existence. Let's unpack these verses further. Verse 4. For you are not a God who is pleased with wickedness, with you, evil people are not welcome. This verse underscores the nature of God as righteous and just, highlighting that God does not align with wickedness or evil deeds. It emphasizes the divine separation between God's goodness and the actions of those who perpetuate evil. Verse 5. The arrogant cannot stand in your presence. You hate all who do wrong. Here, the psalmist acknowledges God's aversion to arrogance and wrongdoing. It reflects a recognition of the divine justice that opposes the proud and those who engage in malicious acts. This reiterates the idea of God's righteousness and highlights the inability of the wicked to withstand the presence of the holy. Verse 6. You destroy those who tell lies. The bloodthirsty and deceitful you, Lord, detest. This verse emphasizes God's stance against falsehood and deceit. It showcases the consequence for those who engage in falsehoods, portraying God's role as a just arbiter who holds accountable those who perpetrate deceit and harm. In today's world, where moral compasses often waver and deceit can be prevalent, these verses encourage us to seek divine guidance and protection. They remind us of the unwavering righteousness of God and the importance of aligning ourselves with truth and righteousness, standing against deceitful practices and arrogance. Section 3. Embracing God's Righteousness and Blessings. Absolutely, let's explore verses 7 to 8 in Psalm 5, which beautifully encapsulate the psalmist's trust in God's righteousness and guidance, fostering a deep sense of faith and surrender. Verse 7. But I, by your great love, can come into your house, in reverence I bow down toward your holy temple. This verse highlights the psalmist's acknowledgement of God's love as the avenue through which they find access to God's presence. It signifies an intimate relationship based on love and reverence, allowing the psalmist to approach God's holy dwelling with humility and awe. Verse 8. Lead me, Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies, make your way straight before me. Here, the psalmist expresses reliance on God's righteousness as a guiding light amid adversities. 
It's a fervent plea for divine direction and guidance, especially in the face of opposition or challenges posed by adversaries. This verse signifies a surrender of one's own will to align with God's righteous path. These verses hold immense relevance in our lives today. In a world often filled with uncertainties, stress, and opposition, they encourage us to trust in God's love, allowing it to be our refuge and source of guidance. They remind us that despite the challenges we encounter, we can find solace and direction in God's righteousness. The act of surrendering worries and anxieties to God's care, while seeking guidance in His righteous ways, can bring profound peace and clarity to our lives. This deep faith and reliance on God's love and righteousness can serve as an anchor amid life's storms. Section 4. Rejoicing in God's Refuge Absolutely, verses 9-12 in Psalm 5 serve as a jubilant celebration of the safety and refuge found in God's presence. They encourage us to revel in this divine shelter and embrace the promise of blessings and favor for those who remain faithful. Verse 9. Not a word from their mouth can be trusted, their heart is filled with malice. Their throat is an open grave, with their tongues, they tell lies. This verse describes the deceitful nature of adversaries, highlighting their untrustworthiness and malice. It contrasts the falsehood and wickedness of those who oppose God's ways. Verse 10. Declare them guilty, O God. Let their intrigues be their downfall. Banish them for their many sins, for they have rebelled against you. Here, the psalmist calls upon God to judge the adversaries for their sins. It's an invocation for divine justice against those who rebel against God and perpetrate evil. Verse 11. But let all who take refuge in you be glad, let them ever sing for joy. Spread your protection over them, that those who love your name may rejoice in you. This verse contrasts the fate of the wicked with the promise of joy and protection for those who seek refuge in God. It's a call for believers to find joy in God's protection and to rejoice in His name. Verse 12. Surely, Lord, you bless the righteous, you surround them with your favor as with a shield. The closing verse reaffirms the divine blessings bestowed upon the righteous. It illustrates God's favor as a shield, safeguarding those who walk in righteousness. Applying the essence of Psalm 5 in our daily lives can profoundly impact our outlook and actions. Starting our day with this prayer can set a positive tone, fostering clarity, peace, and purpose as we navigate life's challenges. It encourages us to 1. Seek refuge in God, embrace God's shelter amidst the chaos, finding peace and security in His presence. 2. Rejoice and sing, find joy and express gratitude for God's protection and blessings, allowing our hearts to sing with joy. 3. Walk in righteousness, strive to live in alignment with God's ways, knowing that His favor surrounds the righteous as a shield. In practical terms, incorporating Psalm 5 into our morning routine can anchor our day in faith, helping us face adversities with a renewed sense of purpose and confidence in God's unwavering protection. Practical Tips for Morning Prayer Absolutely, crafting a meaningful morning routine centered around Psalm 5 can profoundly enrich our spiritual journey. Here are practical tips to integrate Psalm 5 into our daily routines for a deeper connection with God. 1. Create a sacred morning routine. Begin by setting aside a specific time each morning, preferably during the quiet moments before the hustle of the day begins. Find a serene space where you can reflect, meditate, and pray. Use Psalm 5 as your foundational prayer, allowing its verses to guide your thoughts and intentions. 2. Reflect and apply. While reciting Psalm 5, personalize its verses to resonate with your own challenges, aspirations, and emotions. Allow the words to speak to your heart, addressing specific concerns or areas in your life where you seek guidance and protection. This personalization deepens the relevance of the prayer to your daily experiences. 3. Gratitude and Intentions Incorporate gratitude into your morning prayer by expressing thanks for blessings, opportunities, and the gift of a new day. Set positive intentions for the day ahead, aligning them with the themes of Psalm 5 seeking guidance, embracing righteousness, and finding refuge in God's presence. 4. Consistency and Persistence Cultivate consistency in this practice. Make morning prayer with Psalm 5 a habitual part of your routine, allowing it to shape your mindset and actions throughout the day. 
Even on days when time feels scarce or challenges seem overwhelming, prioritizing this prayer can anchor your spirit and provide strength. Additionally, consider journaling your reflections after prayer, jotting down insights, emotions, or any guidance you feel you've received. This journaling practice can deepen your connection with the verses of Psalm 5 and serve as a record of your spiritual journey. By integrating these practical tips into your morning routine, you'll not only establish a deeper connection with Psalm 5 but also nurture a profound spiritual practice that can positively influence your outlook, actions, and relationship with God. Closing Thoughts Absolutely, concluding with the profound significance of Psalm 5 is a beautiful way to wrap up our exploration. Here's a refined closing thought for the video. As we draw this journey through Psalm 5 to a close, let's carry forward the understanding that this scripture is more than a prayer, it's a powerful tool to anchor our souls amidst life's turbulence. May the wisdom and guidance found within these verses empower you to start each day with renewed faith, strength, and purpose. As you embrace its teachings, may you find solace in God's presence, guidance in His righteousness, and joy in His refuge. Let Psalm 5 be not just words spoken, but a transformative force shaping your mornings and, indeed, your life's journey. This encapsulates the essence of Psalm 5 as a guiding force and encourages viewers to embrace its transformative power in their daily lives. Thank you for joining me in this profound exploration of Psalm 5. As the beauty of the morning surrounds us, may the words of this sacred psalm resonate deeply within you, guiding each of your mornings with unwavering faith and purpose. If this message has resonated with you, don't hesitate to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until we meet again, may you stay blessed, and may your faith remain steadfast and strong.